if you're in the market for a full leg massager, this video is for you. Hey guys, I'm Elizabeth. Let's take a look at the Quinier three-in-one foot, calf, and thigh massager. It does all three areas, all in one machine. Let's check it out. So I plan to use this unit for recovery and relaxation after my workouts. I've debated on getting one for feet. I've debated on getting one for just lower legs, but I decided why not just make one purchase and get an all-in-one unit? That's what this is. This is the first time I'm seeing it and trying it out. So this is an unboxing and a demo. All right, first thing I notice is that it's super compact and it's portable. It is made to travel. So if you're gonna take it to the gym or if you are on the go, it's packaged up just right for that purpose. All right, here we go, let's get into it. Inside the package you get, ooh, here's your control unit instructions power adapter nice long cord here's one leg and here's the other leg they're conveniently labeled in more than one place right left see the marking there one design feature i love already is this zipper right here so you won't have to fiddle with endless velcro with this zipper in place right here so this is the calf and the foot portion Here's the thigh portion. The thigh portion is Velcro, and that has got a nice, generous size range. As you know, thighs can be lots of different sizes. This will accommodate a nice wide size range. Here's the biggest range for the thigh. The smallest is gonna be closer to this diameter. Really little thighs. So very versatile in terms of circumference range on the thighs. All right, enough unboxing, let's try it on. All right, here we go. This is a place where you should be able to see pretty well what I've got going on. Let's see if we can figure this thing out, shall we? So first up, I've got it plugged in. I'm guessing this goes to the yep. So your hand control here has three different plugins. One's going to be for your power source and then one for each leg. Leg plug. The leg plug looks like this. You see you've got a spot for a three prong and a spot for a one prong. The one prong is your power. Three prong is for a leg. All right, we'll plug it in. And then I'm not sure which is which, so we'll just take a guess. Okay, we're all plugged in here. That's a fancy display. So you've got three different modes, combination, circulation, and sequence. Three different strengths. It goes from min, mid, and max. And then heat is also min, mid, and max. So this button here will turn on your heat. Min, mid, max. We're going to turn on max to the hottest. And strength, we're going to leave that on the smallest because I've never done this before, so I don't know what to expect. Although it looks like they're already starting to inflate. So let me pause this, turn it back off, put them on my legs, and then I'll turn it back on. Let's do the right leg first. <laughs> One leg is on. Okay, here's how they fit me. For reference, I'm about five foot three. Here we go. Turn it on. I'm going to do my heat at the max and strength will leave at the mid. So far, I don't feel anything. Okay, we're about maybe a minute in and I'm starting to feel some compression on my feet, so that's great. All right, now I can definitely feel the compression on my feet and it's working its way up my calves. So my feet definitely have a squeeze on them. My calves are starting to feel some compression there as it inflates. And it's neat to me that it truly does work its way upward, which of course is exactly how this thing is designed. Definitely feel a great squeeze. Remember at the beginning when I said I'm going to leave the strength on minimum, that was the right call. The instructions also suggest that when you first start out, you leave the strength on minimum until you get used to it. Stick with that. Okay, so now we're a couple minutes into it and it's gotten to my thighs. So the thighs are starting to tighten up now. Again, I love that it truly does go in sequence. Now that my thighs are feeling the squeeze, the feet are almost completely deflated. So my feet are free to wiggle around. My thighs are definitely feeling. Again, uh, with that foot to calf to thigh motion, it's definitely going from the feet and working its way up higher up in the body. That is a really nice level of compression. Okay, so it just released the thighs and now I can feel that it's starting again on the feet. It starts at my toes and it's definitely working its way up. That whole cycle took about five minutes. Now that I've completed the first cycle, I can definitely notice that the heat is on because it's making my legs feel warm. I didn't feel much heat for the first cycle, but I definitely do now on the second cycle. You can definitely feel it warm, like a heating pad or a warm blanket would feel. That's how these feel. And I've got the heat on maximum because I'm kind of a cold person all the time. Okay, this cycle seems to be going a little bit faster because it was maybe a minute ago that we were at the toes, then the calves, and now I'm already feeling some compression on the thighs. So it seems that the second cycle works its way up the leg a little quicker than the first. And this feels great. 
Now I understand why these things are all over the internet and why they are selling like crazy. Now I get it. All right, the second cycle seems like it took about two minutes to go from feet up to thighs. So now we're starting cycle number three and it's again back on my toes and I can already feel it working its way up. It's nice and warm on the heat setting. This is definitely a great product. I'm really glad I decided to try this out. And now, like I said, I definitely understand what the hype is about and why you're seeing this all over the internet. Now that I have felt all three elements, the foot, the calf, and the thigh all together, I think that's the only way to go. I can't imagine now that I've felt how all three work together, I can't imagine getting just the foot model or the foot and the calf model. It feels like all three is the most effective way to go here. So that's it. I hope this overview was helpful. This is definitely a great product. It's made with that carry bag. It's easy to set up, easy to work, easy to figure out. Definitely recommend.